What's up, everybody? Welcome to Durham, North Carolina. We are here exploring. Uh, we're off of Angier Avenue. There's a little event going on here. I'm here too. Yeah, buddy. My route is kind of blocked here today. This is a funeral procession. Uh, okay, if we got out of the way, they can make it easier. This is a funeral procession here on the left. To the left of us. If you got out of the way, they can get out a lot easier. You know that, buddy? There you go. We got some type of event, news crews. And then, I don't know, a lot of stuff going on around us. And a funeral procession in the other direction, so. Quite uh, the eventful day here. I saw a car that had a Venezuelan flag sticking out the front window. Cool. There's a lot of Venezuelans supposed to be here. I've seen a lot of Venezuelans at the, in Cary. It's kind of like Florida, but you know, conservatively. A little corner store right here. Metal bars on the windows. I've never been here before, so this is our first First appearances, first impressions of the town. Never been here before. We're kind of uh, on the east side of town here. East Durham is the neighborhood we're in right now. New house right there. What you think so far, baby? Nice. Nice. It's not cold that one. Mm -hmm. A well trained wife. Durham. Uh, I keep saying South Carolina the game video. I had to restart this video like five times. That's in the Carolina somewhere. <laughs> somewhere in the Carolinas. Why is this person opening the door? Some of these houses are pretty. Yeah. Not all. They've got some little tiny little house right there. Not bad at all. Somewhere under the ocean. I'm going to just make a hood version of that song. This is there's some pretty houses here. Front big front porches. I like big front porches. Now let's go straight. This thing's stanced. It's squatted? Yeah, sure enough is. <laughs> you don't have to get rid of that by the end of the year. I heard they're imposing like really strict um, regulations on people who have squatter trucks. Kind of ridiculous. The crap that matters. I don't want to fix their car. Let them fix all the crap they want. Somewhere under the ocean. How's the song go? Somewhere. Are you sure that's how it goes? Over the rainbow. Over the rainbow, yeah. Somewhere over the rainbow, way up high. In touch you of her love. Under the love, love I, I, I. Somewhere deep in the hood. Whenever I hear that Purple. song, I think of that like... You remember in Super Mario 64, he was like riding rainbows and stuff? Yeah, he, uh, he's questionable. I always wondered about him. Oh, no, like you... Like in the actual game, where it's up high and you're flying into rainbows and stuff. Trying to get coins. 
I like that game. Can I get a 64? You can get a 9 to 5. Yeah. <laughs> I'm a jerk. <laughs> I like it. I like playing 64. Mm -hmm. How is this gonna make me money? I'm doing a YouTube channel on it. <laughs> you know what? You might be successful. <laughs> because everybody who does this Nintendo online thing, yeah. they're all the same. They're all like, I think I'm just gonna follow this black man around. This guy looks like he knows where he's going. Well, Interstate 85, is it? Can we just take that up? Sure. I'll do whatever. Somewhere over the rainbow. Purple Seville swing with 22 zone chrome. I'll make a hood version of that song. Pupeceria, no sé qué cosa. There's a lot of Salvadoran stuff. I like pupusas. Things are good. Somewhere deep in the ghetto, Cadillac swing. Peep on probation drive. Oh, this looks like West Lobo. I like it. This reminds me of West Lowell. The style of houses. I'm gonna make a hood version of that song. <laughs> That's the type of thing that would blow up on YouTube. Yeah. See, I have so many talents that I don't exploit. I'm not greedy, I'm really not. <laughs> if I was greedy, I would be making parody songs on YouTube. I'm not doing that, but... Yeah. I have the time for it. Like, I would just make a hood version of that song. And I'm fat, so I could just, I could sing it with a ukulele. Oh, look at the food market. I love it. Man, I love hood stuff. Metal bars on the windows. Dude, that store looks so hood. Yeah, for my 64 game channel, I don't win the first round, usually. You suck at video games. Yeah, I suck at video games. A channel about people who oh, suck at video it's games. Oh, watch out, watch out. And you can watch someone suck at video games. Be like, oh no, you should have did this. Somewhere, the cops coming at us. <laughs> Over the rainbow. Oh my god, that dude's skinny. Yeah, that was. That was so good. Somewhere over the ghetto, blue the veil swing. Oh, dude, I love the city. It's so hood. Like the buildings are so hood, right? Yeah. Man. And then there's like a little bit of gentrification here and there going on to like switch it up. I love it. Yeah. I mean, that one's got metal bars in the second story. All the way up to the second story. That means that when you, when you put metal bars in the second story, like you thought that, I'm like, yep. Somebody's climbing. Somebody's climbing for a steal. Somewhere. Deep in the ghetto, Blue the Ville swing. 
Yeah, we're gonna lose. Plus, like, all the people that used to do really good animations on YouTube, they, they started sucking. Now, there's a town period. There's new buildings going up over there. This might be a good place to invest because it might be it might be on the come up. You think it is or no? And it's it's yeah. everybody everybody says this is the bad place. This is the bad place, right? Well, that's the place where eventually mm -hmm. the place that people think is bad. That's the place where eventually the you'll most, hit. You'll like hit. The most... Yeah, because appreciation of prices. It's just it's that simple. It's price appreciation. Okay. It's gonna happen. People want to be in a certain area. There's a neighborhood that's a little. Well, eventually, like, there's, that area like gets filled up too. Like in Cary, right now, there's three properties available. What type of economical development can you have in a place like Cary right now, right? People think it's good. Oh, there's only three properties left in the marketplace. How does only having three properties in the marketplace lead to economical development? That's why right now they say that Africa is the best place to invest in the whole world because. Mm -hmm. um, they're going through what do they call this? There's a, a name for it, like development. Jose, look no, at not that. Development. Latino what? Credit union. <laughs> I need a con. I have. I use my city. Latino credit union. That's interesting. Yeah. See, that's a, that's what happens. Like eventually, they just try to put all Latinos in one place. I didn't know you could have sound system in a motorcycle. Yeah. Let's go north here. Are you allowed to turn on red here in the state? Oh, it's a one way. <laughs> You're not allowed to turn that way regardless. Yeah. <laughs> it's like, it's a one way. You can't go that way regardless. I want to go down that road. It looks neat. Mm -hmm. Okay, this is down. But, anyways, economical oh, development. Oh, cool. Down here. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Econo and look, economical development. Happens, Old school McDonald's. Happens in places where there's potential for appreciation. How can how can a place appreciate when there's nothing left on the market anymore? Yeah. There's no appreciation. How? There's just nothing to appreciate. It's there's nothing on the market. Well, that's a weird concept, but like places like this have better potential for appreciation. Yeah. So like when, I, when everybody told me, oh Durham, Durham, it, it's going in the bad direction. It's going in the bad direction. You know. I'm like, yep, that's probably the place where you want to invest. Mm -hmm. Where there's fear, there's money. Mm -hmm. Are we stumbling upon another one of these festival thingies? Yes. Somewhere. That girl's definitely cute when you saw her. Yeah. There's mm -hmm. a Jamaican flag right there. Where are we going? Uh, Can we go this way? Can we go to this way? There's, There's only a Jamaican one way flag. to go, and I think it's that way. It's a Jamaican flag. Cool. Mm -hmm. uh, Jamaican food truck. Oh, girl, I want to taste some sweet. I want to love you ever since I saw you at the bar. So I can get it. What's up with all these events today? It's Saturday. Oh. Okay. A Saturday on Labor Day weekend. Okay. Yeah. Okay, so we need a GPS, uh, that place, um, Lynchburg, what was it? Petersburg, Virginia? Mm -hmm. I think this is a, a place that has potential for appreciation. It doesn't look as bad as I thought it would look. Oh, there's, ooh, there's a bunch of stuff going on. Okay, I think we just hit, like, Millennial Central. What's going on over here? I see like all types of colorful millennial type of things. I think we just hit like millennial center right here. Okay. Petty's 
Wiped out with an Asian girl. You know, I've noticed, I've noticed, um, Asians with Hispanics here and like all types of like weird interracial dating. I love it. I really love it. This is very millennial looking here. What am I doing? What's it going on? Going up to Roxborough. Yeah. We just hit Millennial Center here. Look at this little strip right here. It's like Millennial Center. Yeah, it's kind of cold. They gentrified it. Yeah. This is really gentrification here. Yeah. It's from, see how they're gentrifying it. All these new buildings? You know what I'm saying? Total gentrification. They're definitely Spanish. Same. No, they're, they're all definitely Spanish. They're definitely Spanish. <laughs> Welcome. So this place does have potential for gentrification. Oh New houses being, it's not that bad. I mean, the people here in Carolina might think it's bad because they, they're comparing it to like Cary and Apex, you know what I mean? But like for, let's say like Black Lives Matter, it's just different than the rest of the other places. What do you think, this is, you think this is really as bad as people think it is? There's a book. There's like a little book up. Can I see them up? I don't think this is bad. No, there's I mean, like I, a book hut. I mean, you can tell it's 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 an inner city in Lodow, you know. I think the what we've heard we've talked to a lot of locals here in the Carolinas, <laughs> and they say Durham, Durham is bad, Durham is bad. But I just think, you know, compared to the rest of the Carolinas, put this in Alabama, it wouldn't be that bad. Mm -hmm. Turn left onto North Roxboro Street. Put this in South Georgia, it'd be the best towns in the whole. <laughs> put this in South Georgia, trust me, it'd be a top ranking top ranking town okay. so it's all depends on your perspective I mean the, the, the stuff's not run down these houses they're actually building new ones so it's not as bad as people say it is somewhere over the rainbow Cadillacs on 22's shine And Shine We're less than two hours from Where are talking about moving Somewhere in Virginia, right? Lynchburg or where was it? Petersburg Petersburg I'm not in a rush, bro You probably be in a rush Oh, good. Well, look at that house. Like, there, there, there are houses here yeah. that have potential. Mm -hmm. what, what, I mean, if, if, if people think it's bad, these houses might be pretty cheap. This might actually be a good place to buy a house, baby. Mm -hmm. Only use a little bit of work. Mm -hmm. Rehabil rehabilitate it. Yeah, we're okay, do it. Start watching the market. It's probably like a Montgomery, though. You know what I mean? Like, right to like you might think it's nice the first time you drive through, but then when you spend the time here, then you're like, ugh. Yeah. Anyways, if you're from Durham, all the other towns, all the other towns, these are big green houses. Well, Montgomery, look at Montgomery, Alabama. Yeah. Bro, Montgomery, Alabama has some incredible neighborhoods, and it's not a desirable place to live. It's not that the houses are ugly, they're beautiful. It's just that there's a lot of crime and stuff, so... Could be one of those deals. I think it's your turn to drive. Let me see if I can park somewhere. So I drive away here. You're, you're driving for sure. Somebody's personal driveway. You know, I'm tired. Mm, I ain't getting on no highway for it. Ah. I'm parking on the side. Oh, there we go. You ready to drive? Yes, you are. Tell my government. Beautiful houses. Still an undesirable place. It's not the house, it's just the crime and all the crap you gotta do from the neighborhood. Alright, guys, there it is, Durham. I actually like it, even though I've heard horrible things about it. But make sure you give me your thoughts and opinions about the place, especially if you live here. I'd love to hear your thoughts and opinions. Make sure you like and subscribe. Yeah.